Hello, welcome back to KJ Gaming Network. I'm Austin, and this is Factorio Mod Madness. Last we left off, we did some pollution cleaning modules and some upgrades and stuff like that. But now, it's time to do a bad thing. We're going to decommission our secondary pollution unit right here. Because we have too many pollution modules. Oops, wrong one. Okay, so, get this out of the way. As you can see in here, we have 312 modules. We don't need that anymore. All we need to do now is keep this thing going, so we're going to go ahead and stop this one right here. Mainly so it won't suck up all our modules, our, um, what are these called again? So electronic circuits, so it doesn't suck them all up and we have to keep making tons of them. So this way you can keep on going. The only thing we have to supply is steel. Also, you can see I'm creating some um, fast splitters. What we're going to do is we're going to fix a little bottleneck we have, like this right here. I decided I'm going to go ahead and just get rid of this, the first and this uh, little um, section off right here. This one's right here is fine. Anyways, once this gets done, also let's go ahead and grab uh, some more pollution cleaning modules, number two, from up here. Now we got 19 of them. Also, our researchers got done with bullet damage too. Let's go ahead and take a look and see what else we can do. We could go ahead and do flamethrower, but we don't have the technology. Well, we have flame flammables yet now, but we don't actually have the actual building up to start making stuff like that. We could do upgraded tanks, but not really. We don't have that great of a steel production yet. Uh, let's just take a look and see what we can do. Let's do bullet damage three. Oh, we can't do shotgun damage three. Okay, bullet damage three it is. Okay, let's go ahead and take our fast footers almost done. Okay, then. Let's go ahead and place some of these. These guys have it. Yeah. These don't. Okay. Uh, okay, there we go. Now, most of our mining machines now, mining drills now have. 1.8 pollution, 80% less than what they did have, so that's great, really great. We are going to tear down our steel production over here soon and try and fix it. Uh, for a second now, I'm going to go ahead and fix this. We're going to just place this right here. I'll place this one right here. And just have it loop around so it starts filling both sides. This will cut. This will pile back up. I'm sure of it, but at least it will help it somewhat to get rid of some of the stuff in front of it. I heard that our stuff right here is all packed. We could turn our iron production back on, but I have a better idea. Instead, I'm going to just go ahead and upgrade our chest to steel, and we're just going to go ahead and pile up some more iron. get another uh, fast inserter and that should help with some of the demand in production at least then uh, where's our mining our mining one's completely full uh, we could try and find a way well it is uh, yeah it's full on both sides technically. But this right here will just kind of help us build up some stuff. Now I'm thinking I should just go ahead and degrade all our stuff back down. Yep, that's fine. Let's let's not let's not use steel. Steel's just a uh, too much storage. We'll just have this one right up here take the storage. Everything else is fine at how much are they holding? 6,000. At least now everything's a lot clearer. I guess if it bunches back up again, we can do that, but don't really see a point in it. All we'll do is take our uh, regular line of assembly down. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look around. We'll go ahead and grab a couple more of these. We'll just go ahead and take a look around, see if we can add any of these to anything. Uh, what other mods have productivity, which, what do they do? 
creates extra products at a cost of increased energy consumption. Hmm. Might have to make some of those. Decreases energy consumption of a machine. Minimum energy cons consumption is negative 80%. And speed modules. Uh, I'm thinking maybe speed modules for a copper wire and electronic circuits. Also, maybe some producti uh, productivity. Let's go ahead and go to our oil plant and see if we can go ahead and start working on it, that a little bit. I had an idea is we can make a train station down here to bring oil into our city to make plastic. Unless we want to make plastic outside of the city. And then transport it all the way over. Mango, I didn't think that thing, that electrical line had anything on it. Why is it almost there? Do you need to hit up uh, some power or turks down over here? Okay, everything's full, right? About, are you guys still working? Why aren't you working? Petroleum must be full. Petroleum is definitely full. We need petroleum mostly, so we'll go ahead and add this onto petroleum line. And then as a backup, we can add these. So now these two machines should keep on going. Let's go ahead and give it a pollution cleaning module. Actually, I don't even know if it needs a pollution cleaning module. I would say speed, just because in the past, these things are slow. And it'd be good to increase their speed a little bit. And I guess we can give them a pollution cleaning module too, just so that it's done a little bit. So now it's pollution is only like 2.3. Because when you give it a speed module, it'll act as a... Um, It'll keep pretty much uh, gaining pollution if you give it other modules. Okay, so we got four petroleum, three light, and four heavy. We could make one more and just give them all four. I have no idea at this point in time. So where's our chemical plant? We got two chemical plants. So I just need to remember how to do this. I'm thinking we'll just do it all in this area over here. So it's kind of, we have a big open area instead of it being all crammed down here. So let's just take a look at it like about right here. So what are we making? Are we going to make a lubricant? Plastic? Okay, plastic bar. We need coal and petroleum gas. So how do we want to do this? We got coal right here. We could just, yeah, let's, let's definitely do that. Let's uh, make a miner. Cancel all you. So we'll make a miner right here. We'll import it over here to get storage. And then we'll also put the petroleum up to it. We could just do it right here just because it won't take up much room. So we'll try and find the way to get it like right up even to it. Let's say just about right there. Then we have enough for inserters and boxes. Let's move it back closer one. That should work, right? Now let's just go right here. Trying to make it as good as possible so we don't have to mess around with it much. This is 3,000. Let's do it right here. I'd like to get a big electrical line just so we can have some power over here. Got to make a couple more of those. What's this? air filter machine max health 150 energy consumption 200 kilowatts and it gets a pollution we may have to go put some of those in this area so we don't get attacked we'll make one of those in a bit go ahead and get a couple of electrical ones there we go place down a, a light or a lamp right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and make some pipes. Don't know what type of pipe we want. Let's just do, hmm, capacity 50 liquid. Hmm, tempting. Let's do that. Okay, so we'll need three of these. 
There we go. Now all we need to do is get this uh, coal going. We'll just put a steel chest. Just so we can keep on going. We can do whatever the heck it wants. And you know how we were talking about productivity. Let's give this thing a speed boost or protect a productivity boost. Or just both. So since it, it regularly creates how much pollution? Uh, nine. We'll give it one. It does 5.4. We'll give it two. It does 1.8. Okay. Wow. I have a lot of wasted uh, modules then. A lot. Okay, so we're going to get productivity. And we'll just see how much better it does. We'll go ahead and get a fast inserter. Where did our fast inserter go? Oh, there it is. Okay. Got to get a electrical one. Just stick it over here in the ocean. It'll go on to a fast inserter. We'll just get rid of that for now. We'll get another fast inserter. This will take it off the line. And I was thinking put it onto a freaking box, but that's not gonna work. So, new idea. Make two fast inserters. And let's get a couple of containers. There we go. And this will take it from box to box to box into the machine. So it kind of acts like a buffer. There we go. So see, this is going to keep putting it in. And then, yeah. So it kind of acts like a buffer. It will keep on going. So production module. Give it it. So every time it does a couple th lines, it will start increasing and give it a free one. I'm thinking instead we should just give it a speed module. Because if it acts faster... Wait, no. Does a production module make it go faster? Yeah, it looks like it, but I'm not sure. Let's just give it a... How what about speed module? Uh, I guess we'll just do a speed module. I guess it will help. So let's go ahead and get another fast inserter. And we'll get a plastic bar. So the plastic bar, we can make it come out the back here and go straight on down here so we can deliver it to the main factory. Or we can eventually load it up onto a train and take it to our base. Which I'm thinking we may, we, uh, we might do. So I'm going to just put this here, give it a crate. A big steel crate. And just let it do that. For now. And then, once we get trains and whatnot, we'll put a little train station here, we'll load it up with oil, we'll load it up with plastic bars, and we'll take it straight to home, to our base. So let's go see if we can do something with this stuff, because we're going to have to do something with it, because if we don't, it's just going to it's just gonna get full and this thing's going to stop working. So let's go ahead and make another chemical plant. If I can find it. So let me just click it and see what we can do. We can make solid fuel out of wait, lubricant. Yeah, let's make lubricant with heavy oil so we can make stuff with lubricant. And then we'll make solid fuel out of uh, light oil. Let's make a couple more of those pipes, the super long ones, and we'll just build it all over here. Awesome, it goes all the way around there. Let's go and place one over here. We'll just come over here and try and find them. Awesome. And this one goes all the way here. Good. Awesome. Great, it works. It fits anyways. Uh, our, now our things, let's go ahead and just attach these. I would like to try and get them as close as possible so we don't waste room, but oh well. Uh, electrical lines, awesome. They fit. Well, I can fit both of them. Okay, this one is heavy oil, like this lubricant. And this one is light oil. We'll make solid fuel. Okay, so now for storages, let's get. I would just say steel, just so we have tons of storage room. Uh, let's get two fast inserters. And here's our little storage tank. Let's put this right here. Hmm. 
wondering if we hook up both in uh, intakes, if it will make it so we can actually produce more, but I, I, I have no idea. Let's go and have this, put it into a steel chest. And you can go ahead and put all your lubricants in there. So anyways, that's all the time we have now today, so we'll go ahead and discontinue here. We also got bullet damage 3. So anyways, subscribe if you want to see more. All a subscription does is if you see, it will basically send you an email or a notification saying a new video has came out. Thanks for watching, like if you like it, dislike it if you hated it, but really, how can you hate this game? It's so fun. Thanks for watching.